In this episode, we are going to give you a detailed tour of the Cosmo Cruise Port that's coming up. We're Kelly and Jason, exploring the world one cruise ship at a time. Our goal is to give you the details that you need by capturing as much as we possibly can on camera and hopefully bringing you some laughs along the way. Welcome to the Travel Scouts family. Cozumel, Mexico is one of our favorite places to visit on a cruise and in this video we are going to show you what it's like from the moment you step off the ship all the way into the cruise port, even to how you get a taxi. We wanted to let you know we have several good resources for you in the descriptions below, so make sure that you check that out. And if you're new to this channel and you love cruising, please consider subscribing and make sure you hit the notification bell so you don't miss it when any new episodes publish. So right now we have just arrived in Cozumel, Mexico. We are so excited and we are going to Mr. Sancho's for the first time. So excited about that? I'm super excited about that. We've been to Cozumel like how many times? Many, many times. We've never been. So this will be a new experience for us. So let's go. So as you can see, there's a pretty good walk in from the pier to get to the port area. So a little bit of walk in there, but they do have the little bikes where they can hold two to three people on board those. If you want a little assistance for getting in there, it would be customary to tip for that, uh, but that is available for you. So you know what I just noticed in here? Actually, if you forget something like a selfie stick or a cell phone water protective case, they actually sell them in this shop, so it might be good to know. One key tip when you're arriving in Cozumel, Mexico, you will generally notice that most people will go through this big tax and duty free store. It is a long walk through with tons of shopping, but it's very much a bottleneck, so it takes a while to get through there. But most people don't know that you don't have to go through there. There is a wide open walkway to the left side of that tax-free and uh, tax -free store that uh, as you're coming along the left side of that, you can go straight up to the very end where you go through the little checkpoint. It will save you a lot of time. There's lots of souvenirs in there, but don't be tempted to buy those yet because once you actually get into the larger shopping district, there's gonna be all kinds of souvenirs. They're gonna be a less price probably, and you can negotiate and bargain with the people that are in those uh, locally owned stores. When you come aboard at Cosmel, if you have an excursion booked, if you're wondering where you link up for that, once you come through the port tax and duty free shopping area and you have a little security check on the other side, you will have all of these men and women that are holding different signs with the number on it and also the names of the different excursions. That's where you link up and from there you'll get your transportation to your excursion of your choice. One of the things I love about Cosmel is the picture opportunities that you have available. As soon as you get off the ship, there are so many fun things that you can take your picture with. So grab your camera, grab your phone, have it out and get ready to snap those pictures. Okay, so Kelly and I right now, we are headed to the taxis. If you're wondering where to get the taxis, if you're going to Mr. Sancho's like us or to another location, it's really hard to get lost in the shopping area of Cosmel, Mexico. What you'll basically do is you're gonna go to the left through the shops and then back to the right where you get to the taxis. But you don't have to remember that. You can ask any of the workers around the port area. They're gonna direct you in that way. Basically, if you just follow the main paths, you're gonna end up where the taxis are at. You know you're almost at the taxi area when you come to this big hut walkway that's directly behind me. The taxis are on the other end. One thing that Kelly and I love about Cosmel, Mexico is you don't have to be in great question about how much the taxi fees are. When you get to the area where you actually get on the taxis, they have a rate sign that is posted so you can see exactly how much it's gonna cost you to get there and how much to get back. So it definitely simplifies the process and takes some of that anxiety you may have about some sort of scam or something like that. Okay, so we are going to Mr. Sancho. So you can see here, it is $17. Now that's $17 for one to four passengers. And then if you're gonna be five passengers, it's 23. And if you are six to eight passengers, it's 34. But it takes all the guesswork out of it. So we're, we're going, going to Mr. Sancho's. Yes. Mr. Sancho's costs you only $17. And you got to make line right there with the okay. guy with the blue shirt. Give you Mr. Sanchez. Next one. All right, very good. How many are you? Next one. Ah, Two? Yes. Thank you. 
So one of the amazing things about Cosmel is that it is so efficient. You literally show up at the taxi place, there's plenty of people asking if you need help, they let you know the rates up front, and then when you're ready to get in a taxi, I mean they have someone ready to, to coordinate that for you and you're like in and on your way before you know it. So super, super efficient, fast. probably one of the the most well-oiled machines for a port of call that you could ever imagine. These guys and gals know what they're doing. Yes. So we are going to Mr. Sancho's today, and Mr. Sancho's is a place where we highly recommend that you go ahead and make your reservation before you actually get into Cosmel because it does fill up quick sometimes. We hope this information has been valuable to you, and if so, please hit the like button, and also make sure to subscribe. The next video that we have coming out is going to be a tour of Mr. Sancho's in Cosmel, Mexico. You don't want to miss that video. We hope to see you on the sea soon. Thank you so much for watching and God bless.